I know a lot of people are thinking about running a spring marathon and I just want to give you a heads up or let you know that the time to start training and or planning for that marathon is now. Uh, most half marathon training programs run anywhere from 10 to 14 weeks and the uh, longest run on that first week is usually three to five miles and then the following week you're going to add another uh, mile onto that long run so you need to have some base and here we're going to be training for the uh, half and the full pig and that's going to start actually the week right of uh, New Year's so our first meeting is going to be on the four, or the 4th of January so that means it's actually going to start in December and that's going to be 18 week program so if you're thinking about doing it, and that's if you're doing the pig. So if you're doing a different one, uh, you know, you have to kind of start planning. That's why I'm saying you need to start planning now to see which one you're going to want to do. If you're going to do a full marathon, those programs usually run anywhere from 16 to 18 weeks long. And your first run is going to be anywhere from 7 to 9 miles. And uh, you need to have a base. So depending on what you've been doing, if you're coming from 5K to go to a half marathon or you ran a half marathon, planning on going to the full marathon, you need to start planning now and looking ahead to see uh, what you're going to do. What we suggest here is that you do have a schedule and a plan. And what that, I mean by that is have a set, you know, this week I'm going to run so many days, I'm going to run so many miles, I'm going to have my long run, and that you're going to have... It's scheduled out and planned out for your 18-week, 16-week, whatever, whatever plan you're going to do. We can always help you with that. What I like to do is I'm going to tell you about some of the marathons that are coming up. We're planning on doing the Flying Pig, which is uh, May 4th. So uh, that one we would hope you would come and do with us. But other ones that are out there are on the 6th of April. There is the Ohio River Ohio River uh, Road Runners, they're in uh, Xenia, Ohio, has theirs, and that's on a uh, Saturday. So that's 14 weeks from June 4th. Uh, the April 12th, the uh, Carmel Marathon in Carmel, Indiana, you're talking 14 weeks. So that's why we're saying Athens in Athens, Ohio has their marathon that Sunday, which is the 13th. Once again, you only have 14 weeks to train for that full marathon. Uh, April 19th is going to be the Kentucky Derby Festival Marathon. So if you're thinking about doing that one, you've already done the pig and stuff, you have 15 weeks starting January 4th, and that's when you start. So that's why you need to kind of start, for one, pick out what marathon you're going to do, see what kind of plan you're going to do, and you're going to want to get some kind of base. Next, we got April 27th, the Glass City Marathon, which is in Toledo, Ohio. That would give you 16 weeks to train for. Uh, in Canton, Ohio, they have the Pro Football Hall of Fame Marathon. So that also gives you 16 weeks, and then we're talking May 4th back to uh, the Flying Pig. So uh, May 18th, if you're going to really push and maybe do a warmer one, you would have the right aid in Cleveland, and you would have 19 weeks. So the whole reason I'm, I'm throwing those out there at you is you need to be thinking now about what you're going to do. The biggest thing we recommend, like I said, is to have a schedule so that way everybody in family knows, hey, when I'm going to start working out, what days, because um, January, February, probably not that much going on. But uh, March and April, the kids start doing a bunch of stuff, so you want to kind of get everybody set. Marathon training, half marathon training is a uh, long season, but uh, you need to start planning. If you need any help on uh, a schedule, uh, what kind of workouts you should do, please contact us here at the store. Uh, like I said, the, the biggest thing is to have the less stress is you want to make it fun and you want to just have a program in, in place and uh, we can definitely help you with that program. So uh, good luck at picking what uh, spring marathon you want to do. We're uh, always here to help you out whatever your running needs are.